Hello, I'm in um, Kobe right now. I'm going to, uh, I don't know, just go to Kobe and walk around and stuff. But right now, it's, they got a whole bunch of these, um, with these, these candy shops. I forgot what the word is for in America, though. Um, starts with a C, I forgot what it's called. But anyway, there's one store that's down the street here. I want to get a uh, video of it. So, if you guys happen to see it, see that in the States, then you'll know where it came from. Or it could just be a franchise. But anyway, it's real cool, these buildings out here. They're building, these are apartment buildings stuff. This street is called Route 2. And it goes all the way to Umeda, Old Bay. It's a really long street. It's um, maybe the second um, international route, maybe. They have a Route 1 that goes really far to, I think it goes from Tokyo to Kyoto, Osaka, maybe even further down, but I'm not exactly sure. It's pretty cool. Call these family apartments. Mostly families live in these. And uh, well, they could be condominiums, but I don't think so. I've been up in places like these teaching English to people's homes to the kids and stuff. And uh, it's pretty cool though. Okay, you see the other side down the street here. The cars are going by. Ah, oh, there it is over there. This is supposed to be a very, very famous confessionary. Confess? Con, con. I can't think of its name. It starts with a C though. I've been in Japan too long for getting my English and now I have to start reading a dictionary. Hey, you know, I used to do that. When I go to school when I was in high school, in college, I would just get a dictionary and just open it up to any part and start reading. It's very, very informative. Very educational. Uh, you guys should try reading dictionaries. Not those little ones. Get them big ones, them unabridged ones. Those are better to uh, read. Those are better to read. A lot of history. Yeah. It's a restaurant. This side, I think of restaurant, you can eat inside, there's people in there, car parked in front. Our, our confectionaries, I think it's coming back to me. How big it, <laughs> interesting name, huh? We say big it, they might say bigot. Bigotto. There it is. So just in case if you uh, see a, um, some candy or something. Put that name on it. It comes from next door. Well, I don't know exactly this branch, but well, I like it anyway. Here's somebody's house. It's really interesting. On these streets, they have uh, the houses and apartments and everything all mixed up. But uh, I guess the houses and the business, they can be, they, um, I can't say that my English off but messed up. They are built like right next to each other and stuff. There's a post office. And the post office become a bank, so they merged. Which is cool. Ishinomiya. Ishinomiya. You guys want me to talk to some girls? But there aren't many around. But it's a couple behind me, they're cute. Let's see again. She got some man. It's pretty cool. The back street. I don't know what that is. I think it's a apartment building. But I'm not sure. I'm sorry. Hello. How are you? You speak English? <laughs> no English. Wow. Okay. No problem. But anyway, this is whole day. It's hot out here. So hot. They got my car over there. You got two people I was just talking to, but they're shy. So. Oh. 
and they have lots of um, how you say that orthopedic shops. I'm not sure, but anyway, glass, glasses, orthopedic. My tell my ink is all messed up. They got a lot of glasses shops around here. Whole bunch of them. But this is it. Here's a look like a business too. I don't know if that means some fish something. Okay, that's it. I'll try to get some more footage later. Bye.